So, here we are. Martin here with Modola Musical Machines. This here is, oh, I don't know, a sibling of the Thompson's Creek guitar, only in keeping with its larger body, deeper, more space to vibrate in there and everything else. We've got a little more of an expansive name for this guitar, too. This one is the San Gabriels, in honor of our brand new national monument. Um, that uh, we here in Claremont happen to live at the foot of, San Gabriel Mountains. Um, I just uh, showed you some routing, and so I basically completed that process. And it's, you know, it, it gives me a very, you know, very close place to start from when I'm actually doing carving. As I mentioned in the last one, I don't do, I, I don't like these 90 degree angles from sides to tops. I generally will carve a nice, you know, uh, organic thing, because I like to watch the the uh, figure and everything else move through the wood uh, all around. Um, plus, there'll be a lot of uh, ergonomic carving on the back here. You see it's a little dark here around where these knots were. I'm doing a little bit of um, finishing epoxy in there just to make sure that it's all structurally solid. Uh, all of these areas are pretty much solid anyway. The chambers really just go to about this area, so it misses this entire area. This is all basically from here up, all solid, you know, wood. Chamber is essentially, as they say, in this area. And uh, on the front, we'll have a nice sound hole here, and I'm debating on whether I do another one there as well. I think that, you know, that one of the purposes of making the body as large as, as I did it's a little larger than the you know, smaller one, um, was to be able to do that, to have sound holes on both sides. But we'll see. Maybe I don't do that. Um, but at any rate, there'll at least be one there, and that's going to open that tone up a little bit more. As it is, though, I think... Uh, I think it's got a very nice sound to it. Anyway, there we are. That's the next step. I'm now going to go eat some lunch, let the epoxy do its thing, then I'll level sand on here, then I'm going to start essentially uh, carving, um, you know, and, and doing the various interesting things that I'll do next. Okie doke. See y'all.